All right, guys, we're out here fishing a pond I fished before. Uh, it's a little bit earlier in the year than I've ever fished it before, but hopefully, because we're fishing it a little earlier, we can get on some bigger fish, because hopefully the small ones haven't moved up. This fish, I, I, know, I know this pond holds big fish. My dad's caught in a four out of here before, and I've heard stories of some pretty nice ones coming out of here, so I'm out here with my dad, my brother. Hopefully, hopefully we can get it done today. We're just gonna be fishing jigs and maybe even a little bit of moving baits and stuff like that, so. Maybe we can get it done. Oh, that was terrible, but get on some nice fish. So, see how we do. And you goes farting again. There you go, farting again. You are. Was building up he had to let the pressure go somehow he's trying to hold it and that movement just let it slip <laughs> oh got him moving bait oh swimming it you caught it swimming it huh were you swimming it in yeah it's probably a lot of glare right there that was my fish <laughs> that was what dude just called he was gonna catch there's a lot of glare that way on the camera but <laughs> you can release them. That's probably a lot of glare, but yeah. You were reeling it in when he bit? Yeah. The heck? You never set the hook. You gotta set the hook. That was like a five pounder. He was huge. You gotta. <laughs> I didn't set it right. Yeah. Dad lost another one. Probably about two, two and a half pounder, huh? Yeah. Dang. Yeah. You keep losing them. I'm not liking my odds right now. I feel like this pole doesn't have a backbone to set. It does, believe me. I hook fish like crazy with that thing. What is this? A medium? Yeah, medium heavy. Your rod right here is just. Yeah, my pole huge. Is you just, you just when when you feel them, what you do, Dad, is oh snap! What the heck? Broke off. You had a bite? I got a huge bite. That was a monster. But this is only twelve pound test. That was a monster. Oh my gosh, huh? That was humongous. I'm going to have a heart attack right now. I've never felt so much weight behind a fish in my lifetime. That was the biggest fish I've ever felt. Oh my gosh. And that fish was huge. That just hooked up. And by the time we've been losing so many fish, it's insane how many fish we've been losing, huh? Yeah, this guy felt heavy. That's yeah. Weird. But it's crazy the amount of fish we've been losing right now. The big ones are biting right now. They just got to land them. We have the problem with us though is we have equipment for Lake Mead. And when you fish this real thick stuff, it can get hard because, you know, Lake Mead 12 pound test to us. Jig fishing is kind of heavy or I mean perfect. But out here, a 12 pound test is nothing. So we're running into a little bit of difficulty there, but we'll make it work one way or another. Put some nice fish in the boat. Fish on, Juju. Dang, how far out were you? Are you stuck or what? Look at all this wind. There's a lot of wind noise here. Does he feel big or what? Oh, catfish. <laughs> Nice, they'll bite you. You gotta hold them like that. <laughs> I, <laughs> <laughs> I serious? got bit by one of those last year, yeah. Is it hurt? No. Where are the spikes at? On the, the same spot they always are in the fins. Look, you don't know how to hold the catfish? I got 
Jeez. It was pretty heavy. Where's those pliers? They are kind of heavy. Look how fat he is. Little yellow bullhead. No, they'll chomp down on you. That's it. Is it? It doesn't hurt? No. I already got him out. Thank you. How do you, you, you want me to hold it? Like I am. You see this right here? Mm -hmm. Um. Look, so catfish have a, a spine right here, right here, and right here. So what you do is I always take my middle finger and put it behind the spine and index over, thumb behind. Crazy. Just grab them by the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to do a transfer. Wait, is that the end of their fin right there? Yeah, that's where the spike is. So put your thumbs like, put your fingers like I got it. Wait. All right, thumb under. Hold them tight. You're going to feel bones. Hold them tight over those bones. Hold them tight. Yep, there you go. Don't drop them. All right, go ahead and let them go. Nice little catfish. Oh, yeah. Good job. You gonna leave me hanging? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of catfish out here. Yeah, you've caught. You caught two. Oh, yeah. Ah. Hold up. Get him. Get him, get him. That's a nice one. Oh my gosh, that's the second big one we've caught so far. Yeah, it's filming. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Aiden, good job. <laughs> this is the second one. You lost one probably this big too. Oh my gosh. Look at the size of this fish. Oh. Hey, good job. <laughs> That might be, that's probably my PB right here. I'm going to call this my PB. Whatever this is, get the scale out. It's on the right side. Right side of the bag. Probably four pounds. That's your PB for pounds? Huh? I thought your PB was like 60. No. We thought it was about five, but this guy is a four pounder for sure. Zero it out. Zero, zero. All right. It's all zeroed out. Mama. 394 so it's a three 3.9 pounder so we're gonna go ahead and put this in the live well uh, this is the second one this big we've hooked into already so I have a feeling it's probably gonna be a pretty nice day <laughs> Get hey, some more. best of the year yeah that's the best in Nevada for me well yeah, I think so. It is. 3.9? Yeah. yeah. So I'm just going to call that my PB since I never have a number. So my new PB is 3.9 pounds. Ooh. Another little guy for my dad. Tiny little dude. It's a nice one. Caught him on a little weightless crawdad looking thing. Tiny little guy, but always fun to catch. Yep, for sure. There you go. Are these big mamas? We got on a little stretch where there were some big ones, and I haven't been able. It's been a little while since we hooked up again, so. Uh, we're getting ready to head out. Adrian's picking up his bass. That's a good-looking bass right there. That's a Look really at that good thing. Bass. That's a, our scale has to be broken. Look at There's that. No way that. Where's those extra batteries you said you had? We have the other. I scale. thought I had That's some. Good. We the don't. Ones? I didn't see them. Let them go. Adrian's trying to get length right. and girth on them. So, I would say that's about zero. Oh, wrong side. Jeez, my butt's getting wet. All right. It's about 19 inches. 19 inches? Get yeah. around that belly. We're going to get around, the, get around that, that belly. belly. All right, so this is kind of hard to do. Right there at the big part. I've never gotten girth on a fish before, so this is... Don't pull it too tight. Yeah, don't pull it tight. Yeah, yeah so right, right there. What is it? 13 and a half inches. All right, we got some this nice is, pictures. This is a, a slap me, <laughs> but this is a real nice bass. Uh, very glad I caught him. Been trying to catch a nice one for a while now, but I'm gonna go ahead and let him go. You know, let him go, let him grow. So nice one. Bite my hook again. Do me a favor. Bite my hook again when you're five pounds. All right, so we're gonna let him go now. All right, go ahead and let him. You go. Well, there he goes. Swim off. He's right there. Yeah, he'll be good looking. I'm with the net. I didn't want to just fall out my hand. He's good. 
Yeah, he's good. He swam off. It wasn't the best release, but he kind of jumped out of my hand. He'll, he's fine though. He was perfectly fine. All right, guys, we had a great day out here. My brother came along and my dad also, and we were just having a great time. The fishing right now wasn't exactly like the best, but we did manage to uh, hook up to some nice fish, but just one of those days where they, we couldn't put them in the boat. My brother did catch a nice catfish today, <laughs> but we had a great time. We'll probably be back out here soon. We're probably gonna be doing a little bit of traveling, maybe a little bit of collabs with other YouTube channels and um, trying to get on some good fish. But other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you outdoors. <laughs> what? No, I was just laughing.